you are doing great and so good to see you again i know it's been a very hard journey for you to finish your ore 1 or ls 1 and you know, come to this level where you are looking for uh, mannequin exercises right so to help you i made this video i recently cleared my lds 2 exams i cleared 1 and 2 in lds 3 we have a mannequin exercise so i was thinking where to go and buy my mannequin so when i went to the internet i found there was a company called navada enterprises which i know them a couple of years before and they are in bombay so today in this video i'm going to show you the mannequin how to set the mannequin and how to fix it on the chair see i have a clinic at already so many of my friends they are in uk and they have to set it at home so when i when i saw the website there was a beautiful option for which you know a practitioner can use it on their dental chair without having to invest separately so i was thinking where to work so i selected my clinic dental chair itself so i'm going to show you that mount also in this video how to mount it onto the chair and you can start using it how to put the drainage and everything let's go into the video so there is a small gap here and uh, this jaws are attached here see this jaws you know we can remove this if you want i think uh, this is a full assembly i didn't try to remove this yet if you unscrew this and this this whole component will come so this plates are custom fit for each jaws the one i have is called fresaco jaw and i'll just show you the jaw comes like this in a the fresaco jaw comes like this in a box where you could see you know uh, it's ag3 model so this is the upper jaw there is a screw driver there is a plate inside so here you can just fit in it's a magnet thing people some people like magnet some people like screw type uh, though initially i found it was wobbly i felt uh, magnetic is easy to take photographs to see how you have done and all that so magnetic is easy so just remove this and careful while removing lot of people have dropped it and broken the magnetic component my some of my friends said and you can see here this jaw this jaw is movable okay so why it is to be moved uh, we don't need to move but uh, i'm just telling it's movable so and also it locks gets locked here with that sound so we are going to show you now how to put this rubber fitting of this rubber you know first i would recommend you to fix it in the back like this so in the back there is a slot just make sure you push it nicely the middle part and everything yeah slightly you know it goes is inside and you know this c this kind of c gets locked with that metal thing there and uh, this gap make sure you know this gap you have to slide the uh, jaw the thing is sometimes you no know, when you when you hold it it gets closed and if you find you might find it difficult so the lower component should not be hold it while you fix it and this part you no know, you might need somebody to help you or you can fix it on the fix the head and then you can do so it's okay it's simple but still we we were we were thinking how to do because initially when we did we didn't do well see you cannot do this mistake this is how it happens if you do this this holder you know this holder cannot be placed here so this holder comes here this cannot be placed putting it so what we do is uh, we push this back nicely and then you uh, nicely you push it back make sure this kind of clumsiness should not be there because you know water leaks sometimes and i did pretty pretty so water uh, water was leaking so so push it nicely 
and you know do it okay so over here you see push it nicely so you can see this is how it should be this part should go and fix the thing and then well, one another mistake is one of my assistant just fixed it on the chair like this so you know the water can get compressed and come out the martinga so now fix this then so tighten this screw over that black one the big one so tighten this so that that thing doesn't wobble here and there okay good tighten up and close it and just push this inside easy peasy yes we have fixed it tightening it hold it hold it please so just put this back putting ma put this back good just simple push that's it now your thing is ready now i'm going to show you how it looks inside so you inside there is a clip you know there's a spring type of clip so there are many many different kinds of mannequins available and this is a um, you know clip where you have to just hold it like this if you want to open just it's simple operation just lift it up from the side you could see it is like this so inside we have three screws the bigger metal one and the middle one and the front one basically there is a jaw which is connected to this as you could see i am holding my mannequin head which is from navada so as you could see they are branding over here as you can see this is an l clamp system where there is a l clamp and you can see uh, there is a uh, metal clamp here and there is a ball movement here you can see the ball movement i'm going to show you uh, in my dental chair how it is going to get fitted so this is my dental chair setup and you could see this is a chair called natus and uh, i have two chairs i do implant surgeries there and this chair i am planning to fit this mannequin which my assistant is holding say hi her name is rexia rexia and she is holding that navada head hi rexia thank you so much so here where we have to fit is you you here see a headrest okay the headrest you just pull it out there is a metal rod so rexia is been trained now how to fit this rexia can you just show us a demo how to fit this and this clamp is going to come here this clamp side is going to come here so rest the head like a patient on the uh, headrest and this clamp is engaged here can you see down below there is a screw which madam is rotating and tightening can you see it's getting tightened up make sure it's tightened nicely on the top on the bottom it is tightened and this is a movement where suppose i lock this and uh, you could see this doesn't move okay if you feel it is too much i think the head the headrest is uh, you have to check whether you know Uh, is it balanced or not because when you put some pressure sometimes it can fall so we need to be very careful so here this one is for tightening the movements so what i do is you can see over here it's resting nicely over here and there is a uh, bush here and you can see the water outlet coming from here this water outlet is here so either you can take the suction and you can connect it with this tube see it's a rubber tube either you can connect nicely something like this you can connect like this so you can hear the sound coming from here i could feel the suction here the suction is really good um so i don't want because i it's too much noise for me so i have made, made an alternative which i'm going to show you so i have made a water bottle okay you can see there is a water bottle and this tube gets connected there that's it so even if i move my chair up and down 
this thing doesn't go uh, you know it doesn't fall or anything it's it's quite good it's very hassle free okay so i'll show you inside what it is so we are going to see what is there inside and you could see this is the mount for the jaw it's a magnetic mount it's very simple you can just hook up the uh, my this is my prasako jaw this is what you need to buy for the exam so i bought it from the uh, navada only so i'm just taking this and you can see this is a metal and that's a magnet or this is a magnet i think so that is a metal i am just showing you how to just fix it you just put it inside and check whether it is locked okay it's locked and uh, take this one take this out and put it in so it's nicely locked here inside you can see um uh, it's locked and it's not moving so no problem it's nicely everything is you can see few of my preps over here okay so this is how it is done and bus everything is done your hand piece is here in the exam we will have a table and uh, you know all these things will be there you can just take it and you can uh, you can adjust the chair here you can see so what is the ideal position for the chair as you could see you cannot keep it erect you have to keep it almost flat like this where my the operator's knee has to go below the thing and this is the position so i have to sit straight use a mirror and work okay somewhere from 10 o'clock to 1 o'clock this is 1 o'clock position this is 12 o'clock position and this is 10 o'clock position you are not supposed to come at 8 o'clock no no 8 o'clock in mannequin it is from 10 to 1 and you have to sit straight you cannot bend or you cannot bend you, your neck also is should be something like this you cannot do like this in front of the examiner so be very very careful while performing the try to practice with mirror it's difficult in the starting as you keep practicing you will definitely you will be able to do it nicely okay yes dear friends i hope you had seen a very lovely uh, video about how to fix the mannequin on the uh, dental chair so the numbers uh, for that company is given in the description please uh, like our channel and subscribe i am also uh, training people for mannequin training people for oskies and unseen in india if you are from any other country you are welcome to come and do it here mannequin or you can do online cost everything you can call me and verify and also work really hard don't get discouraged i know many of you are working as hygienist and many of you are working as therapist in uk and you are finding difficult to cope up between work and you know uh, your exercise i definitely say you have to improve your skills uh, with the help of you know uh, practice so practice is important keep practicing if you don't practice in the exam you will feel very fearful and tension so please do it very well and i i request your uh, wishes for me uh, in the month of may i might get my exam so i really request your support your blessings for me and uh, and my success thank you so much for watching all these videos thank you and god bless you